This is Catholic Sunday Mass readings for June the 11th, 2023 and every third year after that for Cor Feast of Corpus Christi Year A, Solemnity of the Most Holy Body and Blood of Christ. The first reading is from the book of Deuteronomy. Moses said to the people, Remember how for 40 years now the Lord your God has directed all your journeying in the desert so as to test you by affliction and find out whether or not it was your intention to keep his commandments. He therefore let you be afflicted with hunger and then fed you with manna, a food unknown to you and your fathers, in order to show that not by bread alone does one live but by every word that comes from forth from the mouth of the Lord. Do not forget the Lord your God, who brought you out of the land of Egypt, that place that place of slavery, who guided you through guided you through the vast and terrible desert with its seraph serpents and scorpions, its parched and waterless ground, who brought forth water for you from the flinty rock and fed you in the desert with manna, a food unknown to your fathers. The Word of the Lord The responsorial psalm is Psalm 147. Praise the Lord, Jerusalem. <clears throat> Glory to the Lord, O Jerusalem. Praise your God, O Zion, for he has strengthened the bars of your gates. He has blessed your children within you. Praise the Lord, Jerusalem. He has granted peace in your borders. With the best of wheat he fills you. He sends forth his command to foot to the earth. Swiftly runs his word. Praise the Lord Jerusalem. He has proclaimed his word to Jacob, his statutes and his ordinances to Israel. He has done thus for he has not done thus for any other nations. His ordinances he has not made known to them. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord, Jerusalem. The second reading is from the first letter of Paul to the Corinthians. Brothers and sisters, the cup of blessing that we bless is not a participation. The cup of blessing that we bless, is it not a participation in the blood of Christ? The bread that we break, is it not a participation in the body of Christ? Because the loaf of bread is one. We, though many, are one body, for we all partake the one loaf. The word of the Lord. Alleluia, alleluia. I am the living bread that came down from heaven, says the Lord. <clears throat> Whoever eats this bread will live forever. Alleluia. The Holy Gospel according to John Jesus said to the Jewish crowds, I am the living bread that came down from heaven. Whoever eats this bread will live forever, and the bread that I will give is my flesh for the life of the world. The Jews quarrelled among themselves, saying, How can this man give us his flesh to eat? Jesus said to them, Amen, amen, I say to you, unless you eat the flesh of the Son of Man, and drink his blood, you do not have life within you. Whoever eats my flesh and drinks my blood has eternal life, and I will raise him up on the last day. For my flesh is true food, and my blood is true drink. Whoever eats my flesh and drinks my blood remains in me, and I in him. Just as the living Father sent me, I have life because of the Father so also the one who feeds on me will have life because of me. This is the bread that came down from heaven. Unlike your ancestors who ate and still died, whoever eats this bread will live forever. The Gospel of the Lord. <clears throat> 